Hello. This is me again. Kind of an odd way to start a video, but I believe this is prevalent. Some people just need a high five in the face. First off, I'd like to uh, thank my kids. I believe it was either Father's Day or my birthday that uh, they got me this shirt. And uh, despite my portliness and weight gain, it still fits. So, with that... It is on this statement that I would like to um, talk a little bit about. I, we are all human beings, and I understand that, um, especially in these modern times of where we compromise our values where we uh, undermine the basic importance of a family unit. I understand that uh, in these modern times, um, the role of men and women are so skewed, are so debased, that it, it threatens the very fabric of society. And I understand how people can be sucked into uh, these views and ideas. However, I do not understand how someone can willingly, by their own uh, open eyes, hook up with somebody that has absolutely no true integrity, that has absolutely no drive to uh, help provide for a home, and especially children, which they are more than likely fathering. I just don't understand it. I see women hooking up with men that have no self-respect uh, or integrity, no traditional values whatsoever. These men are bent on uh, being seen from the world. Heck, they've got their pants hanging off their butts. they got their ball caps on sideways. They've got these uh, uh, piercings all over themselves. Come on, let's get real. Does this person really have it in his head to be a husband and a father and a role model to his children, to his household? No, he is doing. He is wanting to be seen of the world. He is one of these that is sucked into these modern ideals that is going to lead you nowhere. I don't see how women get attracted to these types of individuals. I just don't see it. On the flip side... I see the same thing with men who hook up with these women that have no self-respect whatsoever, that have very little work ethic, that have no intention on uh, being that uh, mother figure that nurturing figure to their children. I just I just see a complete breakdown and, and I see this every day. I see a complete breakdown in 
how the family is viewed, how men and women and their roles are viewed. This has nothing to do with being sexist. This has everything to do with maintaining what a family is. And I see the breakdown each and every day. Hence, we get to... Some people need a high five in the face. Because I just don't see it. I really don't care if these people find these partners outstanding in bed or whatever reason they're doing it. The fact of the matter is the decisions that they are making right now are affecting their entire future, especially their children's future. And what's not being understood is, as an extension of that, it is a generational thing. And I can testify to this. The bad habits that you uh, start out with right now are generational. They will, they will carry on. Breaking from that uh, generational demise is incredibly difficult. In fact, the odds are overwhelmingly against you. So the my challenge for this. Um, video posting is for people to come come back to some sense of uh, traditional values of what a family is supposed to be Est establish those roles in the home a mother a father husband and wife children as a as a husband and wife duly united have parameters have boundaries for your children. There's nothing wrong with that. That is a good thing. It directs your children in ways to go. Anyhow, this is mostly a venting session because these are some of the things I see every day in my occupation. But uh, it really bothers me when the family is being undermined uh, everywhere you go. And when the family breaks down, you have people that are incredibly alone, feeling alone. And you see all kinds of things uh, happening from then on. You see more people depending on the government instead of each other in the family. Um, you see men not taking their place as a provider and a protector of the home who are abandoning their children. You see, on the other side, you see women having children with no intent on having a, a, a husband or you know that traditional family unit, but are very welcome to the idea of having the government support the family. And I have the utmost uh, sympathy for these children. Um, but we have got to get back to some sense of, of, uh, of family because that is where discipline, integrity, wholesomeness are going to be fostered. So that's it for today.